to unlocking your limitless life where hidden inside your biggest problems truly are your greatest possibilities. With me today is Ashley Mulchin. This is our second day together, and today we're gonna take a look at the different body types, which I had no idea there even were different body types. But she's gonna talk about five different body types, what that means to you, how you should eat, sleep, breathe, and be uh, with certain body types, and how to identify which one you are. So thank you, Ashni, for being here with us. I've never heard of this, so tell us a little bit about these five different body types. So how we are showing up here in the world is actually connected to the time that we were perceived, the way that the time, the way we were perceived, if it was a love relationship or it was like some violence or anything like that, and how we are made up. So everything in the whole environment around us is made up of energy. And in that yes, energy, yeah. we have the different qualities. So we have space because in space, everything exists. We have air, fire, earth, and water. So according to these five elements, every single thing is created in this, on this planet. And so is our body. So by the time we are created, it depends on what timing it is. Um, our particular body belongs to that body type. And with this body type, we also have certain things that uh, we should be doing and things that we should be avoiding. For instance, if you are a fire body type, would you go and eat food that makes you more hot? Would you go and be living in a place that is really hot? Imagine you are an oven and you're putting yourself in the fire. What's <laughs> gonna happen with you? So in that sense, you have people who belong to an earth body type, a water body type and a fire. Those are the three um, major combinations. Um, and, and how do they know? So <laughs> if you are someone who is um, a tall, and a little um, slim and very flowy. You're probably a wind, uh, an air body type, according to wind. And you have certain characteristics. Char characteristics. Characteristics. There no, wait, go. can I stop you there for a minute? Sure. So when you say um, flowy, is that personality? Or is that just how your body moves? Both. Okay, both. It's both. Okay. It's both. I think that's what I am. Am I a flowy? Am I an air person? You're, you're a combination. Oh, combination. You're a combination. Here we combo. Yes, you're a combo. I'm a combo. <laughs> yes, so you can have a combo as well. So, but also someone who is 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 a is a air body type, they should not be eating foods that have a lot of air in them because then your whole body gets unbalanced. So it's it's an amazing, wonderful um, science that once you know about it, you can actually balance your life and move in, it, move in this world according to how your yeah. mind works, how your body is, how healthy you are, and the things that you do around you. So, yeah. so can we take each one, each one of those body types and roll with it? Sure. Okay, so a fire, no, an air body, would be tall, slender, and flowy. Yes. So what's the next one? A, uh, fire. Fire body. Fire body. And what was a fire. fire body be like? A fire body would also be someone who's uh, maybe slim, perfect, moderate, mo moderate uh, build. And you can recognize them because their skin will be a little reddish. They're perfectionists. Everything has to be perfect. Um, they get angry very easily, very fast, and everything just has to like be according to them. They want to be everyone's boss, but they never want to be bossed around. <laughs> and I'm pointing to myself. Look at that. I'm like, I think I think some of that is me too. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And uh, the, uh, another one is the combination of earth and water. Okay. That is a combination. And those are usually people who kind of like very jolly, always happy, never have any health issues. And they just like make everyone else feel comfortable. And life is good, but they're usually a little on the heavy side. So they're slower. 
They're slower. Slower yes. go. Slower go. They're going. not the change makers. They're not the. They're 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 going with the flow. Yeah. Going with the and flow. And that's the water. That's the water. It's yes. kind of the flow. Yes. So does the water have its own body type and personality, or does water always combine with other ones? So it's always a combination. Okay. It's always a combination. So the combination is air and water. Fire is on its own, and um, earth and water. Okay. So those are the three combinations, and okay. then you can have combinations of um, those combinations as well. So someone uh, can have a combination of um, the air, earth, fire. I was going to say, is there one where all three are? Yes. In the same body. Yes. Yes. And then according to what is happening at that moment, one of the elements will dominate. It will be dominating. And whatever element is dominating can completely shoot your whole system off balance. Right. And right. it takes some effort to come back to that balance, especially if you have all three in your system. Right. So when we're talking, you're, is it when you're born, when you're birthed, or when you're conceived? It is when you're conceived. Okay. It is when you're conceived. It okay. goes all the way. So it's good for that. us to take a look back at what was happening when we were conceived. What was happening um, when you were conceived, the timing of the day, was it during the day, was it during the night, was it between morning, was it afternoon, was it evening, was it early in the, in the, in the night part, was all there, of that. Was there alcohol involved? Was there alcohol involved? <laughs> was it not, you know, like, was your, were your parents in a good mood or were they in a bad, it's like all of these different uh, elements that make us up. Yeah. And that is something that doesn't change. Once you're born with that typical uh, body type, type, you yeah. are it. That's it. It's a done deal. It's done. It's sealed. Yeah. Fine, sealed and delivered. <laughs> but you can change it if you know what you are through the different things that are available to you. That's tools for everything. So when you say change it, you're talking about having greater ease with what you already are. Exactly. Great. Yes. Well, let's stop here for today because I'm so excited. Um, when this shows up on Facebook, please go ahead and pop down in the comments and let us know, you know, which which body type you are or which, what is it a body type? Is that what we call yes. it? We call okay, it a body, body Five type. body types. Yes. Okay. Awesome. Uh, let us know. We'd love to hear um, if what we're speaking to you about today resonates with you. Head on over to our Facebook page called Unlocking Your Limitless Life. And we look forward to seeing you there. Ciao for now.